Hi, John here. Um, just got in from work. Before I got home, I went straight to the post office as the BAM box was attempted delivered yesterday. Um, I missed it because I was at work. If I'd have got it yesterday, that would have been from the box leaving BAM box office to get into here six days, which is one of the quickest ones I've had. Um, so there we go. Just pitched up. Let's see what I've got. I have seen some videos, I have also seen the different variants because I've seen the spoiler sheet, it was put on the Bandbox community, so looking forward to seeing what I get. So I'll start with this, I'm not too keen on this item, I'm not a big Game of, well, I'm not a Game of Thrones fan, never watched it, never attempted to watch it, but the Hand of the King pin. And that's quite cool looking. Quite big, quite heavyweight. Is a nice item. I do like the look of it, but it just not quite appeals enough to me. Um, so that will go up on my trade post, which is on the the Bambox trading, no, the Bambox collector stroke trading site. Um, the pins, pin I've got is the walking dead it is rick grimes which is the standard pin do like the look of that the blood coming down his face and over his nose and the cuts and marks so and that's done by nick kakosa so do like that and then we have the batman item which is Two faces, double sided coin, um, which one is perfect. The second one, it's got all the damage and scratches. Do like that, it's just a shame it's not a bit more rougher across the back and it's not shiny um, as it was in the film. I think it was Batman Forever, but I do like that, and I've got an idea what I'm doing with that already. I have the Goonies coin, doubloon, the Two Face coin, and the Game of Thrones faceless man coin. Although I'm not a fan of Game of Thrones, I do like the coin because um, that could be just about from anything. So I do used to collect. I used to collect coins, so that'll go on display. Now I've got that. And we have the spoiler sheet. Um, it's got the message about the band box being two years old. Um, this being a two year anniversary. And on the back it's got all the items. I'll go through that afterwards. The print, not got any one up so it's the standard print. But I do like it. I've got number 953 of 2000, and this is by Logan Pact. Logan Pack, sorry. And that is the Stranger Things print. I'm not a Stranger Things fan, but I do like it. You've got the Demigorgon killer back there, which Bam did as an item. I've got one of them on display. And Dustin has got a Bam pin on do like that artwork do like that that looks good um, so not 100% into it I may or may not keep it might trade it I might not it depends what I'm after I've got a wanted list on my post uh, this 8x10 photo has been hand signed by Lee Towsey who operates R2D2 in Star Wars The Last Jedi it was signed during a private signing with the van box. It's that one. Now I do like this picture, but I just wish they'd have used a different shot from the same sort of scene. And that is where you got Luke kneeling down at the side of R2-D2. Now if they'd have had the bit where Luke puts his metal hand on R2-D2, I think that might have been a little bit better. 
I don't mind that. Um, I have thought about the options that they had available. As long as I didn't get that one, I would have been happy. Um, that one and that one are the ones that I really would like to get. So if anybody wants my, that one, which is mine, and they have that or that and would be happy to trade, let me know because I would be happy to trade for either of those two autographs. Um, would have been nice to have got the one with all four in it, um, but unfortunately, it didn't happen. But um, I think one is by Derek Arnold, which is that one is Derek Arnold, and that one, um, I can't remember the name now. Um, but I would have been preferred those two. So if you've got either of those two and you want to swap for this one, let me know. I'll be happy to do that. Um, that may possibly be up for trade, I think. Um, not. I'm not a fan of the show, but I do like the look of the, art, the artwork. Definitely keeping the pin out of the three. I think that is the best looking one. Although it would have been nice to get the 50 pin, purely for the fact it's rare and we still don't know if Carl is a zombie or not. Game of Thrones pin, it's not too bad, um, but that's up for trade. There's a giveaway to win a signed Batman photo signed by Christian Bale. That's on the community. Get over and get entry if you're a Bambox subscriber. That is it for my Bambox. Um, I am quite happy with that. Um, I think myself and a few others... Are, I don't think it's disappointment. I think a lot of people have thought it's the two-year anniversary. They've built the hopes up a little bit based on what the one-year anniversary box had in it. The sign mask by either Skeet Ulrich from Scream or Ari Lehman from Jason... Friday the 13th, I think people sort of got the hopes built up a bit. I potentially did as well, because I was, before I even saw any of this, I was like, oh yeah, cool, I remember doing a trade for some of the items out of that box, because I really liked what was in there. Um, so I think that's why a few people are disappointed, a few might not like the box at all, because they were expecting it to be a hell of a lot better. I don't mind it. The Star Wars autograph, I am a big Star Wars fan, it is associated with Star Wars, so I'm happy in that sense. Would you see somebody who was a main character in there? I doubt it very much, not for the price we pay for the box. Um, would you see it in an expansion pack in the future? Potentially. Would it be a similar price to Stanley and... Val Kilmer, potentially, possibly even more expensive, depending on which actor or actress. Um, but yeah, I don't mind that, I am happy with that. Uh, but my print and autograph is up for trade, as is the Game of Thrones pin. So if anyone's interested out there, I'd go onto the BAM box collector stroke trading, do a search for John McEwen, that's me. Um, you'll find the post on there and all the items I've got I will add these onto there very shortly um, so they're on there um, I am still also after the Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory Charlie and the Chocolate Factory um, signed Deep Roy photo so if anyone has that um, let me know as well um, I don't mind doing international shipping I don't mind doing shipping in the UK so hit me up and we'll see what we can do. Thanks for watching and bye for now.